Let's go again. James Holder, Eiffel TV, in association MTK Global. With me, I've got middleweight contender Willie Munro Jr. Welcome to the UK, Willie. How are you, mate? I'm well and yourself. Good, I'm all right. I'm all right. Good. Firstly, a bit of a frosty uh, reception from Billy Joe Saunders for yourself. Was you expecting anything different from the middleweight champ? Um, no, I wasn't expecting anything different. You know, um, he kept it quiet, though. He didn't, you know, he kept it respectful. He didn't get loud and, and, and really... Uh, Nasty like he's done with other people, but that's because he know who he's in there with so uh, he knows what's gonna happen come September 16th So as you mentioned he does get animated in the past we saw him with Avondale cuts He'd say that yeah. that one was sort of explosive at that time So yeah, was you mentally prepared for a more hostile sort of environment today? I knew he wasn't gonna do that man like real recognized real man like you He wasn't gonna do that with me. He's not stupid. You know what I mean? He knows who he's about to be in who he's about to be in there with mm -hmm. He did that with Hort Sitsa and these other guys man because he knows their style he he knows, I, I know for a fact, Saunders has turned me down on a couple occasions when we tried to fight him. He's pretty much made fight me. Pretty much made him fight me. So I knew he wasn't about to come here and do no crazy stuff. You're not stupid. Mm -hmm. Saunders hasn't been the most active. He's been criticized very heavily for not for not being as active and defending the belt as much as it could be defended. What, what are your thoughts on that whole situation? I really can't talk because I haven't been very active myself. You know what I mean? Um, Got a lot of guys, you know, playing ring around the rosary and don't, don't want to sign contracts or they want to offer you bull crap money that they know you're not going to take so they can get you out of their face, you know, but, you know, I, I, that's, that's how it goes, you know, that's that's the name of the game, that's that's what we call politics, you know, but September 16th is on, believe that. September 16th will be a year to the day since you fought Rosado. One day shy. How, how incredible is that? So, as, as you mentioned, you've not been the most active yourself. Right. Um, are you comfortable coming into such a big fight with, with that inactivity? Absolutely, man. You know, scared money don't make money. You know, bet big, win big. Uh, this is the opportunity that God has blessed me with, and I have to go in. I have to come back over here and do what uh, God has allowed me to do. Now, I want you to respond to Billy Joe Saunders saying that he believes you're a quitter. He believes you're mentally weak for your performance against Golovkin in right. beating the count and then not continuing to fight in that sixth round. How do you respond to that, Willie? Um, I think it was smart. You know, sometimes you have to, you know, uh, this is a, 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 a thinking man's game. You know what I mean? Sometimes you have to know when you're overwhelmed or, you know, a lot of guys go in there and, and you know, they want to put this, you know, this purple heart on, you know, and wear this badge of I'm tough, you know, and then 10 years later after their career, they can't talk. You know, and uh, I had already been down twice. Um, I knew I was down on the scorecards. We were halfway through the fight. Like, look, go home and call it a day. You know, I mean, um, it's, 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 you know, people, he wants to stand on that because he's trying to make himself believe that um, I don't have any heart or, or that he can beat me. Come September 16th, you're going to have to prove that, man. I've never been a talker. I don't, I don't talk much. I don't do all the big, boisterous talking. I don't get out here and get in people's face, man. But come fight night, I show up. Now, this WBO belt is the missing piece of the jigsaw in the Gennady Golovkin, Sol Canelo Alvarez fight. This belt will mean a lot to the winner of that fight. Right. So, potentially, have you got your eyes on coming through this and getting another shot or a shot at the winner of that fight? Absolutely. Absolutely. But... Like I said, the politics of boxing—you never know. You know, they may throw Lemieux at me, or or or, or uh, 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 Danny Jacobs. You know, what I mean, they might try to throw something in there because they don't want to deal with that style. Do you so think you your style know. and you know maybe not the bigger marquee name that they would want coming off the back of that fight? Do you feel you'll be a bit of a curveball? I would be a dangerous curveball for them, and they'll do like they've been doing minimize me get in the media and say he's not this he's not that and try to encourage the fans to believe that i'm not who i really am so they can say well we don't got to fight you mm -hmm. so i'm looking forward to it i you know I, it happens and all i can do is keep training keep winning like i've been doing now billy joe's a very slick southpaw you're a southpaw yourself how in the past sometimes when southpaws fight it's what cancels each other out a little bit it's not right. the most it's more of a tactical affair how do you expect your fight with billy joe saunders to play um, i think it's gonna be explosive you know what i mean um he's definitely put some fire up under me you know running his mouth the way he did you know um i made it kind of hard on himself but this is boxing mm -hmm. so got a fight prediction for me willie how do you see it playing out anything you can give me easy work on that note Willie Monroe Jr. thank you <laughs> had to walk <laughs> off <laughs> so we had to it's walk off <laughs> thanks for your time thanks today. a lot bro